Hi, I'm Devin, and I'm a CEO. I'd give uh, Phantom Buster a five out of five. For more reviews, just click the button below. Yeah, so before Phantom Buster, um, really ev everything we did was uh, link reaching out on LinkedIn one by one, a man or manually trying to connect with people and message and otherwise connect. And it was um, a, a long and uh, time intensive and burdensome process. And um, Phantom Buster made it a lot uh, quicker, simpler, and easy. Or I chose Phantom Buster uh, simply because it was uh, the option that uh, came along that looked like it had the features of allowing us to automate things, make it simpler, easier, it was uh, reasonably cost and uh, integrated with the other uh, CRMs and systems we were using. So it uh, seemed like a good choice for uh, when we wanted to kick off the project. So to, to get Phantom Buster up and running, it was pretty easy. Um, we used it along with the CRM. It was originally with HubSpot before we migrated it over. We're also doing it with uh, Zapier, and uh, it was uh, one where it integrated pretty well and, and pretty streamlined. Um, Phantom Buster also had uh, er, er, quite a bit of uh, helpful materials as far as how to, to get things set up and guidance, so it made it a pretty seamless process to get it up and going. Yeah, so anybody that's considering using Phantom Buster, I would say, you know, most or probably on the forefront is to do a bit of your homework, less on Phantom Buster, but more on the avenues that you want to use it for outreach. So if it's LinkedIn or social media or whatnot is, you know, rather than just using it as a tool, do a little bit to see how it works best, what works best with your business and otherwise integrates well and kind of what messaging and the types of workflows you want to use. And if you do that homework on the front end, then it becomes a great tool for your business.